a lot of people say, you know, oh yeah, it's silly, you don't need me, like, you know, we, we need me, we need me to be alive. Bullshit. Yeah. yeah it's all bullshit. It sounds like, like you, should be, you should be here chatting with people with us. <laughs> You're already yeah. ready to go, I think. Yeah. No, I, I, <laughs> this is an interview from a recent outreach event I attended. I think it went quite well, so if you're curious about the questions I ask, um, be sure to keep an eye out for the captions um, below, and yeah, I hope you enjoy. Yeah, so I guess what's what's been your experience, I guess, with your friend being vegan and kind of what's that made you think about? So, the things he eat, and like, on a daily basis, what he like, make, he basically buys just like vegetables and, and fruits, uh -huh. like thons of them, uh -huh. and he just makes uh -huh. milkshakes like every day, yeah. every, and it's just like, oh my god, like that's amazing, you know? I think, yeah, because you, when you think of veganism, do you think it's something that is, is kind of more expensive or more complicated? No. Yeah, because I, I guess you have a friend so. firsthand that's no, kind of... No, definitely not what... You know, you buy a box of apple for two pounds, you know, and then make a milkshake of that, which is amazing. Like, over um, across the road, I have um, friends from Peru and his dad. Um, her dad always makes, like, fresh juices. Uh -huh. And, like, it's a, I look over there because I just love that. Like, uh -huh. it's amazing. We always love it. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that's a great thing because I'm really lazy in the kitchen. And yeah. it's great that you can just buy bananas and just, you and know, just, you've got yeah. a meal. And yeah, definitely. Everything right. I used to be, like, really microwave mm. dependent. And yeah, yeah. Exactly, yeah. So you were saying earlier you consider yourself kind of an animal lover and... Yeah, so I love chicken. I oh, don't okay. really like pork and all that, but don't eat any seafood. Hate seafood. No, don't eat fish. Never was a big fan of it, but when it comes to chicken, I'm like, oh my god. As far as eating, yeah. My, my best friend is vegetarian. She's uh -huh. not vegan. She's vegetarian. And yes, she's been for years. You know, she just never touches me. No, no, she just... She just doesn't mind, which uh -huh. I just don't know. Like, she used to be, she was used to eat chicken and everything, and now she's like, yeah, just so healthy and thin and stuff. Like, oh. Yeah. yeah no. do, you, do you think that there's a positive uh, health benefit that could come yeah, from there veganism? Is. There is definitely. Like, I mean, if we look how many like there is obesity even in England. Great point. You know, I just think there's an excuse for people like, oh yeah, I can't help it. I mean, no. You just eat so much meat. You know, you see people at McDonald's, KFCs, and Burger Kings, and all that, and it's all uh -huh. meat, really, related. And they just sit and eat, you know, and they just moan that I'm so fat, but you don't do anything about it. <laughs> but if they were to go vegan for a year, <laughs> yeah, I think it's just ha uh, having an open mind, which it sounds like you do, which is great. No, no so. I definitely, I definitely, I mean, agree with all of this. So how do you feel about kind of the animal cruelty side of things? Oh, uh, just, do uh, you know what? Anything I see on Facebook, like, I can't watch. I just can't because I love animals so much. Uh -huh. Like humans compared to animals. I would save animals compared to humans any day. <laughs> I mean, and you can then, do both. It's just, you know. Yeah, but then I feel like, well, yeah, but I'm selfish because I eat like chickens and stuff. Yeah. But, and my friend has chickens and they're like her best friends. And I'm just like, oh, like, I don't know. It's very hard. Do you think that when you buy, uh, uh, you know, animals to be eaten, it's supporting kind of this? Like, do you think you're voting with your dollars when you buy a chicken sandwich, for instance? Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, because yeah, if people stop buying them, then why would they have to produce all that kind of... Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, so it sounds yeah. like you're kind of... Have you been thinking about this for a while? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I agree with this so much, and, but there's just not a lot of people that does it. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, but I think a lot of people should think about it. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, so I, um, there's a program called Challenge 22 where you can try vegan for three weeks. Okay. Um, I've got a link to it if you want to. You can check it out, and it's a yeah, really cool program because it makes it really Anything easy. Anything that supports animals, I'm just like, yeah, yeah. just give me. <laughs> yeah, so um, basically you sign up and they'll sign you a mentor, so if you have any questions about like what to eat and all that, because I think it's really just kind of giving it a go, like you are saying, with you know people eating a certain way yeah, and, and just, yeah. just trying an alternative. Yeah, a lot of people say, you know, oh, yeah, it's silly. You don't eat me. Like, you know, we, we need me. We need me to be alive. Bullshit. Yeah. You know, it's all the bullshit. It sounds like, like you should be you should be here chatting with people with us. <laughs> You're already yeah. ready to go, I think. Yeah. No, I, I, I do think, I do know. I mean, they, they say, yeah, it's bullshit, you need meat, but then they, they look at their dog and they're like, oh my god, I love you, you know. But people Great in China point. eat dogs, cats. Great point. And you know, and I said this to my boyfriend the other day, I'm like, that is disgusting because I have a dog and she's like my best friend. And I said, that's, you know, that's yeah. disgusting. But he said to me, yeah, but for them, maybe it's disgusting that we eat, we eat pigs, cows, you know. And I'm just like, and it's the same stuff because I 
because they're an animal. They need, you know, as much love and support as dogs and cats do. And I'm just like, yeah, I can't disagree with that. But yeah. So what? So what? What do you think would be uh, some of the potential challenges? I think if you if you were to try veganism, like do you think uh, finding the yeah, like do you think finding food to buy or what would be not kind even of the, finding food to buy yeah. because I don't think it's that easy. If you were to know exactly what vegans eat and everything, which I do some things, um, and yeah. I just think it's making yourself full more because obviously if you eat me a few sandwiches with me, you're full. But then being a vegan, you have to like. But I guess if you drink a lot of milkshakes, that makes you full because when I was on a diet, that's what I used to do. Because yeah. you have to cut me off, and yeah, and that made you full. So no, the people make excuses, I think. And they that's don't. Do you know what? They don't like watching things like that because they know that they're in the wrong. <laughs> like I don't like watching that because what? I watch it, I feel sad, but I eat it. So yeah, but at least I know I can I can face it. Whether people are like, nah, that's fine. Or that's like basically you just people put this up on Facebook and stuff for you to just feel sorry. Blah blah. Yeah, no. Yeah, I think it's about open, having an open mind. I think the great thing about the events like this is people only stop if they want to. Yeah. But you can just keep yeah. carrying on. That is so your it's mind. Really... Like, same with drugs, alcohol, everything. If you put your mind to it, like, I'm not going to do that, that's it. Psychology. That's event. brilliant. Oh, it right. sounds like you're really ready. <laughs> so here, let me give you a, a, a card. Yeah. Um, so what... What this has on it basically is a number of resources. So yeah. these are all free on YouTube. Mm -hmm. I've watched everything I can, can is find it out quite there. Sad, though? Oh. So I don't. Um, um, it's not. It's not graphic. Okay. It's all kind of talks and informational. Mm. I don't really. Um, I think the graphic stuff's out there if you mm. want to find it. I don't really tend to focus on that. So it's really just a matter of, you know, just information. But at the bottom, um, uh, if you want to, you can check this out. I don't know if you have a phone or you now. You can even sign up now. Um, this challenge 22, and then it's just basically three weeks, and you give it a go and, and mm. see if it's for you. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So, did you guys like a few of them, or? Yeah. I mean, do you want some of them? Yeah. Okay. Did you have any thoughts yeah. you wanted to share? Or? Uh, my dad's just like to listen. He doesn't. Yeah. He definitely agrees with that the same, but yeah, like it's not easy, is it? Yeah, I, th I think that's a uh, because I actually started up a group. Um, and I think it's all about talking about this in, in a positive way because I think a lot of um, there's a lot of uh, it's, it's not always um, an easy topic to be discussed, and I think that's why people don't talk about it. But if we can talk about it in a comfortable way, yeah, more and more people, people will be well, embracing it. Like talking about because they don't like to face the truth. Yeah, yeah I think you're right. Well, like, I think they don't. It's natural, to, you know. I, I know I naturally felt, you know, I didn't want to think about that. I was supporting mm. the systems, but I think once you come around to it, and, and you're you're willing to consider, you know, yeah, um, the definitely. other side of it, it's so liberating to realize that you don't support it, yeah. um, and, and, and you're not going to continue voting for mm. it. And it's like it's, it's quite a nice light bulb moment. So. Yeah, no, definitely. Oh, thanks so much for chatting. Oh, no, that's. I'll so give you another fine. one. You guys are amazing. I love you all. <laughs> I Cheers in. Save the animals. And, and at the bottom here, um, this this is my email. Okay. So if you ever have any questions, yeah, just, yeah. Just definitely, definitely. Yeah, yeah. I'd like to know what you live on day to day, day as what you eat yeah. and stuff like that. You know. Yeah, shoot me some messages. That'd be awesome. A lot of people like I know um, Kasha. Kasha. She was like she was big, but she is so thin now, and it's just like I don't know, so much happier, healthier. She's really thin. She drinks milkshake, fruit. Cause they they went um, they they went raw, vegan raw, uh -huh. for like a few months, and uh -huh. then they start doing the other things. Yeah, but they're vegan now. They used to love me and stuff, you know. And yeah, I was kind of pescatarian for maybe 12 years. Okay. And when I went vegan, and, and it was mainly cutting out the dairy and cheese, I lost 25 kg like in four months. And I just had a knee surgery, and I was just on the couch. So that's I, the yeah. power of what we put in our mouths is so it is. both short oh, yeah. and long term oh, yeah. health. I think. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's really cool, guys. Definitely, definitely. Sounds like you guys can have some nice chats about it. Yeah, I don't like watching those videos. It's horrible. Yeah, and I, I think it's, it's good to know that it's out there, and I, I think yeah. there's a place for yeah. it, but people, those, those resources are all them. very informational, yeah. so just a lot of stuff I think it's good to know. Yeah, um, definitely. The, the information speaks for itself, so. No, I agree with it so much. Oh, thank you, guys. Horrible, horrible yeah. people out there. Thank you. <laughs> Take care. Look Cheers. after you. Yeah, have a good afternoon. You Bye. Yeah, so that was the interview. In my opinion, they are in the contemplation phase, and it's my hope that as part of our chat um, and the subsequent reflection, that they'll move into that preparation or action stage um, as they've acknowledged the issues, and it's really just kind of moving them towards acknowledging that there's something they can do about it. So I really focused on building their support network and helping them get the tools in place so that they're ready um, um, to give veganism a, a, a good shot. Um, if you think the chat was effective, let me know in the comments below. Um, if there's some strategies you uh, think that were particularly effective, um, let me know that too, and maybe some things that I could work on. So really appreciate any feedback you have.
Yeah, and I just started experimenting with the uh, uh, thought bubbles. So if you thought that um, uh, was a, a good addition and helped it um, to be more engaging, uh, let me know that too. Do you want to miss out on the next video? I didn't think so. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. See you next time.